Lawmakers signed out early this afternoon knowing they're going to have to come back. Some bitter budget wrangling at the end and both sides still seem at odds over all of it. Both houses ended about four days early without approving budgets for the Attorney General's office and MDOT. If a new budget isn't approved by June 30th, the AG may not be able to keep attorneys who defend the state of Mississippi. It could mean layoffs for those who do road work. The transportation fight hinged over a last-minute effort in the House to direct Internet sales tax collections to try and fix roads and bridges. It failed, and both sides still pointing fingers at each other. All three of those conference reports, we actually um, did not know that there was an issue in the House of Representatives. We took all three of those bills up and passed them. Uh, on the Senate floor. There's a real uh, problem, I think, on the Republican side facing the needs that we have on infrastructure. And the bottom line is we're going to have to spend money to take care of our highways and bridges. That's the bottom line. And the, uh, the Republican leadership can't figure out a way to get there. Uh, and I think what we need is a good, good old-fashioned bipartisan compromise. The magic question, of course, is when will lawmakers return to the special session? That is a decision that has to be made by the governor. No indication from the governor's office when that might be. May is certainly a likely a month, but it has to be done by June 30th. The fiscal year starts July 1. Live at the state capitol, Scott Simmons, 16, WAPT News.